What's going on guys? We you YouTuber here back with another video. Here my, my boy Team War right here. Yeah, we were supposed to do a deck review with the last at locals last week, but uh Team War just kinda like fecked off. Yeah, I didn't you know, because he, he's a jerk. <laughs> but uh we're gonna do it now, we're in a we're in a cool like game shop and stuff, so alright, let's get into it. Over to you, so Team War. Standard like three Dark Smells, it's a dragon deck. Wyverns, yeah, we probably should have said what deck it is. It's uh, it's, it's dragon, pretty yeah. standard disaster in dragon build, yeah. So, time. tree wyverns, back up dark metal, remove it in the end phase, yeah, you know, yeah, the usual shit. standard stuff, yeah. Tree drago, because it stops like doors and BLS and chaos dragons, and the newly released hieratic dragons, dragons, completely trolls, heretics, yeah, hieratics, right. yeah. I pronounce it hieratic because of what I saw on dictionary.com, yeah. tree mass dragon, search. You know, floaters, search, shit. Yeah, he's just good, yeah. Duke's floaters, because Chaos Dragons and... Yeah, there's a lot of, there's a lot of shit you just want to run into and... Yeah, that's... Uh, uh, yeah, it's just an overall good card. It gets under bottomless, which is why I'm running it at two now. Yeah, why not? No prime material, because... Um, Especially in this format, Tarantial, two trench, two tranchels, two bottomless. Heroes with their Gemini sparks. Uh, yeah, it's a, yeah. Uh, it's just a it's nice just an awesome play. I didn't run it before. Like, I was running Lad instead because mm. just the Lad loop was really well. Like, it was working really well against insectors and all that. But yeah, I think Prime Material is a better choice for my, like by this time around. Um, one Totem Dragon because it's Totem Dragon. Yeah, exactly. And you don't run any non dragons, of course. No, no non dragons. Yeah. Um, Apocalypse yeah, this kind of text, yeah. Puts in work, you know, makes you, lets you go with the dark end. Um, gets those, gets the wyverns out of the hand and the red eyes into the hand. <laughs> or for, whatever. Dread searches for so whatever, Delta or Totem, if you're desperate, like, yeah. Because um, he's got, he's got cool dreads. That's why it's like the best tuners, best tuner dragons have. Um, yeah. These two, like, go into dark end and start us and all that stuff. So. Search it out with Mass Dragon, um, just basic. <laughs> Spells, of course. Future Fusion must reborn. Yeah, That's first turn combination with both right, of those is basically turn. GG. Heavy Dark Hole. Yeah, staples. Pokemon. The staples aren't necessary to explain, they're just like. Tree duality? Because. <laughs> just for consist just consistency. Just consistency purposes, yeah. It's like. Yeah, a lot of people notice once they started. You want to draw into your power cards and yeah. stuff like that. Like, once, once people start decking three dualities in, in Disaster, it just got so much more consistent. Yeah. And Tree MST. Yeah. Safe zone, Venus chain. Yeah, so much, so much annoying crap. I don't run gold Sark, so it would do. It was better. Yeah, it's it's odd that you don't actually. I dropped Sarko because it's just way too slow. In this meta. Um, Solemn Brigade. Yeah. Because the Solemn Brigade. Standard, standard, yeah. Two Venus chain because insectors and. Because it's fucking broken. It's good, yeah. And uh, wind ups and other crap. Yeah. Whatever deck is still Everything. Like, two torrential. Yeah. Torrential is a yeah. troll card. It's just like one of the few things that we have to stop, like the meta. Uh, bottomless. Burst breath, yeah, I love that, love that tech. Tech burst breath because. No, stuff like. There's so much shit that can go into like four or five monsters and you just uh, go, haha. Chaos, chaos dragons, uh, here, heretics, you know, it's gonna be a big problem. Bottomless, uh, just one because. I just try. I was testing that too. It's just a little bit icky, you know. Why though? If you just say, uh, so I don't know. Didn't have enough space for the second one, but the deep prison because you know the random card troopers and chaos dragons as well, and yeah, heroes as well. For these yeah, two. heroes don't like deep prison. Like bottomless shining. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's fun. Yeah, they deep just get shining. they just get yeah. pissed. Um, extra deck. Sure. Of course. Yeah. If this didn't exist. This deck wouldn't exist. Yeah, exactly. Because I side deck Cyber Dragons. <coughs> oh, really? Deck, yeah. And, yeah. And Why not? Get rid of, like, if you contact Fusion with Cyber Dragon, you get rid of uh, Zen Mains or whatever. You know. It's good. Yeah. My Stroke, Utopia. These are just like random cards. This is pretty good in this deck. Zen Meister, yeah. You can go with the Drago into this because, you know, Earth doesn't clash. Well, these two are a bit like, you know, if I have two Wyverns or if I have two level fours, that's not a Drago, then mm. they're just good standard on Yeah, I personally think my, my stroke is, is one of the best XYZs right now. Yeah. I mean, he's just so versatile. He's just like a kind of a mini Zen mains and a Book of Moon all in one. Like. Go into it with you know, Totem and Delta Flyer. Easy. Or Masked. 
Yeah, it's pretty decent. It's good XYZ, really, very really good. Like. <laughs> that's all of the XYZs? Yeah, that's all of the level 8s. Start a scrap Dark End. Dark End. No, no, it's Wait, how are you going to go into Dark End, actually? Um, with Dark End? non tuner Dark. Delta and... Apocalypse. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, it's, that's the only card, though. It's not, yeah, it it's not very common that would happen, though. But if they attack into, like, a Mass Dragon, you, like... Have this in the grave, and then you normal the yeah yeah. Pitch card get that normal go into dark end. You know? But how often would you go into dark end when you could go into other? Depends on what matchup like or what I'm facing against. Like, if it's a Zen mains, then is that see the, this like yeah? Is that the main extra stuff? Um, it's just like no explanation. Really, so, yeah. Explode or dragon wing, yeah. This gets over Reaper and Gel and Duo and whatever you want. It just blows up. Black Rose just blows up everything. Stall. Black Rose, Sephiroth. Agent Fairy for like Gravekeepers. Grave keepers, dark World, whatever. Dark World shit, yeah. yeah it's good. And then uh, level 6 is. Brynak, Orient, and. Archon. Orient and the all chance that people. This is my drop run. because, you know. Because people just don't run synchros anymore. It's just XYZ all over the place. Yeah, all, all, the, all the tier 1s just go XYZ. Except for Sam's, really. Yeah, but Sam's aren't. Like, they're still tier 1, but they're not popular tier 1, so. Brynak, Archane, yeah. Mill. Good effect, you know. Do you know uh, do you know who's actually is, was, uh, I might as well bring this guy up now in the video, uh, this guy Gravity Warrior. He's well, he's level six and he gains he gains three hundred attack when he's synchro summon, he gains three hundred attack for every monster your opponent controls. And uh so if, you, if they're going crazy with erratics he can bump him up to three thousand or thirty three he starts at twenty one, sorry. And uh yeah, so I have one, but I don't run him in extra. But yeah, uh, he's another cool level six. Just yeah, well you have level six there, so I just told him. What I was gonna say was uh, this against uh, I was on Duty Network against uh, Exodia. Got this out. He milled his Exodia. He just quit. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you heard it from you heard it from Timor first. Milled one piece. Iron Shane Dragon eats up Exodia decks. <laughs> um, like Valor. So, this side deck, by the way. Uh, double Valor, you know, Sectors, Rabbit. Yeah. yeah. Most people main the Valors, so I mean they're just. Yeah, I kind of main it here though. It's like Totem Dragon clashes. Uh, yeah, two DD Crow. Yeah. Uh, Dark World. Dark World. Insectors. Yeah. Get rid of the Hornet. Yeah. Only slows him down though. It's just generic side deck cards, staple. No. Machines, whatever. Yeah. Gets rid of Zen mains, which are very common right now. Pretty standard, man. Certainly. <laughs> two smashing grounds. <laughs> Dino Rabbit. They were going to Dolka first turn, you're like, smash. Yeah. Well, they go to Lagia first turn, they're like, negate. <laughs> But even like if they have Reaper, <laughs> it's good. It's, every, yeah, no, smashing is good. Smashing is good. Reaper against this deck, so smashing just sorts that out. Yeah, smashing is awesome. And Reaper, no doubt, no doubt. On, just, Reaper, Reaper just shits on dragons. Like <laughs> the only thing to get rid of it. Can't do yeah, anything about it. Yeah. Two shadow moves. Uh, not good for uh, shadows aren't great though, and like, because they kind of screw your deck over. And not really. Well, it depends on how you play. If you already have your setup done, and then you can just like. Yeah. The only thing it stops is a red eyes yeah. effect on but the field. Usually you just like make a status and then sell on this, and they can't do anything. Yeah. It's game by that point because the sector is you know, you can't get rid of this. Thing. Yeah. So, uh, dark mode. Yeah. Two dust running because people set into macro and D Fisher. Don't forget about chain burn deck. <laughs> you can't do much against it. Can't do a lot. Yeah. I don't, I don't see chain burn as, you know. What about Linem? Linem, Linem's running, Linem's running chain run. What do you have to say about that? I'm gonna run that. <laughs> <laughs> You're screwed. I'll have, I'll have to see it in person anyway. Yeah. yeah, yeah. If you're wondering who Linem is, it's just a player at a local. Oh, we know. He was in the pack opening. Yeah, yeah. He got the he got the the best uh, quote then, uh, of the whole thing with the the sparkles talking about the additional the lucky straight additional copies of these two for hero matchups and uh, chaos dragons as well. Yeah. And heretics. Heroes hate and then bottomless. <laughs> Well, it's shiny beats. <laughs> I know, uh, but yeah. even uh, but just force and the Gemini just, spark. Just don't don't bottomless the eighties in case they Gemini spark you. Cause yeah, then because then they can just miracle fusion. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, compulsed heroes, whatever, like yeah, know. make them waste their miracle fusion. Yeah, just get rid mm -hmm. of that. Get, get rid of that uh, Zen mains or get rid of that shiny. Yeah. Zen mains is a different deck, obviously, but uh, yeah. That's about it, really. That's pretty much it. Yeah, good. Um, all right, so guys. far so good yeah no it's good uh, thanks for watching uh, we're both trying to find someone consistent to run the nationals but uh, yeah. but uh, other than that uh, you know it's, it's a pretty good deck it's pretty solid um, 
it's generally consistent. So anyway, guys, yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, this is uh, Weevil YouTuber and Timor. Yeah, signing out. Thanks. Hey guys, that was the video. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. And um, stay tuned for a uh, two more videos of Scrap Anti Meta Deck, as well as the first in the series of uh, videos concerning the Heratic Dragons and the various builds that they have. Uh, you got any tips for Timor? Post them in the comment section below. Okay, thanks for watching, guys. See ya.